Charlie? Are you trying to get the flowers to talk again? I tried it. It doesn't work. No, stupid. I'm smelling them. Oh. Why? Because they smell nice. Duh. Why are we standing outside Chang's fiery underworld instead of, you know... Going in! Sometimes I just like to bask in the vicinity and take in the aroma. Oh. Why? It, because it smells nice? Duh! Remember, Rex, give it everything you got. Ready? Three, two, one! <laughs> Whoa, we oh, have a right. off! <laughs> Yahoo! Wait, what are we trying to accomplish again? To experience the almighty stench of Rex T. Mansley's super farts! Oh. Why? Because it smells putrid. Duh! What's a smell? What? You know, you smell them with your... You know, with your what? How should I know? You're telling me you don't know what a smell is? Well, what is it? I have no idea! Did you ever notice bananas are sometimes green? Welcome to the hospital. What do you want? We'd all like nose jobs, please. Do you have insurance? Do any of us look like we have insurance? Fair enough, go on back. Come on, troops, let's get schnozzed! Oh, hey, boss. Your internship is expired! Actually, it expires in a month. Oh. In that case, you're fired! So we just walk into that box? Or whatever that thing is? Yup. Let's go, troops! Jared? 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 Put your head back on this instant! We at Brecht Pictures would like to remind our viewers that this is only a cartoon and that any deceased characters can and will be reanimated in due time. Not reanimated as in zombies, just animate, you know, cartoon. Animated. Just take a chill pill. What happened? Did something drop on his head or something? You may observe from the lack of any shrapnel or any burn or scrape marks in the ground that the explosion was not caused from an outside source, but from within. It may be theorized that our recent nostril implants may be connected to the seemingly spontaneous combustion. I will test this theory by sniffing the air. What is? Stop being dead! Guys, it's our noses! We need to get indoors! How will that help? It always helps in these kinds of movies! Now come on, to the do house! I know this is gonna sound totally delusional, but I think there's a monster out there that's emitting some kind of mystical scent that, that makes people's 
heads explode. That makes sense. Really? Why wouldn't it? So, here's what we're gonna do. We'll hold our breath, exit the house, and seek out the monster, who will be portrayed by this question mark man with a butt until we can find out what he really looks like. Once found, we'll pounce on the monster, let our breath out, sniff, and explode in unison, destroying the monster and all of us. This is a horrible plan. Anyone else got any ideas? I got one. If any part of it involves skateboarding, I'll eat your legs. What we'll do? is head to Chang's and order a bunch of Kung Pao chicken, which we'll plug our noses with. Then, I will skateboard us over to the monster, and we'll sneeze the Kung Pao projectiles at the evil Shuby, which will have no effect, leave us vulnerable, and kill us all! So yeah, that's all I can do. Anyone else? I know exactly what to do. We'll confront the monster and politely ask it to take a shower. It'll then explain to us that if it were to shower, it would die. And then it'll shoot us with an AK-47. And that is my idea. What about you, Mr. Mansley? Do you have an idea? <sighs> does his idea result in everyone's death? Indeed it does. Well, I guess it's up to me then. If you say anything about salads, I'll eat your legs. Noted. So my plan is to have everyone team up and make me a salad, and then I will proceed to eat said salad. And then, having fulfilled my life's one dream at last, I'll sink into a deep depression wondering what else I could possibly do with my life. And, uh, there you have it. What do you think? Not too bad. But what do we do about the monster? Oh, right. Uh... I don't know. Does that mean it's my turn now? Yes, Carlos. It's time to hear your brilliant plan. Oh, I got a plan, all right. We'd like our noses removed. Fine. I thought you were fire.